Hey guys, welcome or welcome back. Today we're going to be watching some more ATs. So excited. This is part two. If you have not seen part one, there is a part one of me watching four songs for the first time. I'm a K-pop newbie. If you need more context, you can watch the first one. A general, like short, short version. I was introduced to Stray Kids three months ago. Now I'm getting into ATs. I'm a Stray Kids huge fan, huge, huge fan. And so now I'm like, let's do some more. Let's, let's delve into a rabbit hole of 80s. Filming this today, I posted my K-pop one, like uh, like my first first one just recently, like yesterday or the day before, and such good positive reception. So many new people. Everyone was so positive and happy. I'm like, where are all these people in my life? Like I need this positivity in my life. You guys wrote like ginormous essays. Right now, counting, there's at least like 300 comments. And I'm telling you, I read every single one of them. They're amazing. You guys write like such in-depth information about all of them. It's so helpful. It's extremely helpful. Mate, do you know how exciting this is and how fun this is for me? I have had such a huge motivation for YouTube. This has been such a positive experience for me. Like you guys are amazing. I've learned so much in like the last week. Everyone was recommending the same guide to me on YouTube. The one that everyone was recommending, I actually watched last night at like 2 a.m. I had my wine. I'm gonna be so happy today. Today we're doing dance practice videos. We're watching a couple of them, a few of them. There's a reason for only doing dance practice videos. First reason is copyright claims stuff. So I got copyright claimed for all four songs in my last video, well, my first one. I watched all the music videos for it. So I picked up all the audio. I watched it in full, like nonstop. From all of the comments that people have been putting in, they say that live performances get blocked completely, most likely, not even like just you know, demonetized and are still public and they just take the money, but like fully blocked. So we're not going to do live performances, unfortunately, because I don't, I don't want to like risk any of that with my channel. So today we're going to be watching the dance practice videos because people were saying that the videos on the actual AT's YouTube, not the KQ like entertainment one, not like any other channels, but apparently the AT's ones on there don't get copyright claimed. So fingers crossed, we're gonna attempt it. It's just that the songs do play, so it may not necessarily be the audio, uh, the video that gets claimed, but it could be the audio. I know I'm doing a very in-depth explanation here, but I wanna explain why I'm doing dance practice videos. That's one of the reasons, copyright claims. Second reason, I love dancing. Everyone said, that they are like perform performers, like the best performances in performers in the industry, and that like they're even better than like their music videos is them like actually physically doing it, like performing. I need to see these dance practice videos because I love dancing, and apparently they're all like great dancers, like all of them. Also, from um, last week when we watched Gorilla, which was my favorite, and I, <laughs> I've listened to that and watched that music video countless times, I did make the point that I need to watch the dance practice. It was like I needed to watch it, and I've been holding out a whole bloody week to watch this because I wanted to see the reception that I would get from the first video and see if people even enjoyed it. And like so many people are subscribing and like saying more ATs, more, more, and I'm like, Okay, let's do a part two then. So I'm sitting on my couch, which I usually don't film on my couch, but I'm like, I want to be comfy while I'm watching these dance videos. We'll start with Gorilla because I don't want to wait any longer, but we are going to be like doing new songs as well and stuff like that. So yes, it's exciting. We're going to do, I think maybe four or five. We'll see. We'll see how, um, how it goes. So I guess let's just start with Gorilla. You have no idea how excited I am for this. I'm so pumped. Like, I'm sure this is going to be amazing. This is going to be so good. I also have my fan. Like last week, I was like, I need my fan. I need it because like, may can I get any more beautiful? Okay, let's jump into it. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, I love seeing the full choreo! This is so good! Oh my god, amazing. <laughs> I've listened to this song so many times, but this is so amazing. And they're backup dancers, they have backup dancers too.
Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys! <laughs> Oh my god, those high tops look so good on him. I'm sorry, why do the high tops look good on him? Why does he look so good? He's capping high tops. Why? Why? <laughs> why? I love his rap section. I love it so much. Yeah. Oh my God, yes. That's the move, that's the move I was talking about in the last video. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? Oh my god, they're yelling. They're yelling. Oh my god, this is insane. I want to see this live. Oh my god. I want to see... Oh, they're breathing at the end! <laughs> Someone in the comments said that they were in Australia like in 2019. That was the last time they were here. Like, please come back. I will so see them. I believe someone said they announced a world tour or a tour or something. Like, please. Oh my god. My fan and wine are like necessities for this. <laughs> I think they're yelling and they're stomping and stuff just like enhance the entire experience. What I love about dance practice videos is like, you can hear they're like, they're dancing. Do you know what I mean? Like the feet stomping and the moving and everything. Like you can hear it, makes it even better. Like for example, the Stray Kids Domino dance practice. That's probably my most watched like YouTube video ever. I love it because there's so much stomping. <laughs> so much stomping in it and this 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 is up there this is up there guys we have a few other yeah we have like other dance videos so let's get on to them sorry about my fan fan girling my fan like that was a bit excessive i'm sorry i'm excessive this stuff like makes you like hype it makes you hyped, it makes you excited. And they're all just like fantastic dancers. I wanna watch live ones, but I can't watch, I can't watch them on the channel. I'm sorry, I can't. I, I'm just going by what everyone has said online and all the comments say that live performances get blocked. So I'm sorry, it's not gonna happen. I'll just have to watch it in my spare time. Or if I start a Patreon, Maybe I'll start a Patreon and I'll just be able to watch everything and I don't have to worry about copyright. Okay, what's our next one? All right, we're gonna watch the Say My Name dance practice. It's a song that I have not heard. I have not heard this one. This is from four years ago. So one of their older songs. I'm sure it's gonna be amazing because every other song that I've listened to is amazing. So yeah, I'm excited. We'll see how this goes. Oh, he's so cute.
god. <laughs> what kings? Oh my god. Oh my god. His raps are so good. And his raps are so good too. Her rapping is so good. Oh my god, that move is iconic. That move is iconic. <laughs> I love their vocal parts. Vocals are so good. Amazing. I love that song. I can see why it was definitely one of their top ones. And that move where they're like, it's like they're leading, like, like they're on a leash. They're like someone, like, a, like are they being pulled? Like someone's, they're holding a leash? I don't know how to explain that move, but they looked so cool doing it. <laughs> the thing is, I never used to be into rap or hip hop. I wasn't, like that was never my sort of thing. K-pop has like totally swung me to like the other side. Like with Stray Kids, obviously they first got me into it because they were the first K-pop band I was introduced to. And like Changbin and Han. <clears throat> Why is rapping in K-pop so good? Like they got me into it and now the rapping in, in for ATs is just as amazing. And I'm just like, <sighs> it's great. It's great. Okay, there's another one now I can now add to my playlist. My ATs playlist will gradually like build up as I watch more and more and listen to more and more. This is definitely being added to it. Great song, great song. Now we're watching Deja Vu. This is one a recommendation that came up a lot in the comments. A lot of people were saying to watch Deja Vu. I have no idea what sort of vibe it is. Um, how long ago was it? It was two years ago. Okay, so not like ages, ages ago, two years. Everyone was saying to watch everything, but this was definitely a song that came up a fair amount. So I'm sure the dancing will be amazing and I'm sure the song will be amazing. <laughs> God, I love his like red orangey hair. I love her. Oh, look at the shoulders. Oh, love that. Oh my god, this is so good. Oh my god, they're dancing. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh my god, I love him so much. <laughs> Their choreographers better get paid well because they're amazing. This choreography is so good. Oh wow, oh my god, did he just grab his neck? <laughs> we'll like set that aside for a sec. Oh my god. <laughs> They know what they're doing. When they do certain things, they know what they're doing. <laughs> that was really good too. I love, I, definitely a different vibe. It was, a, I don't know how to like, it was definitely a lot poppier, a little poppier than some of their others, but I, 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 I liked it. And the choreo was so good. Why is the dancing so good? Why? And oh my God, he looks so good with orange hair. I don't know, the orange suits him. Definitely a vibe. So now we're gonna watch Pirate King. So Pirate King apparently is one of two of their debut songs. So Pirate King and Treasure, I think was the other one. We'll watch Pirate King today. Yeah, apparently it's their debut. So we'll check on this dance practice. I'm sure it'll be fantastic too. It'll be interesting to see their like their debut song and if their like vibe or style has changed at all over time. But um, yeah, it'll be interesting to see them a lot younger because this is like five years ago. <laughs> this is a very long time ago. <laughs> I love his voice. It's so unique. Oh, what a drop. Great drop into the chorus. Oh my God, they're dancing.
I love this chorus. It hits. The drums! Oh! What even is that? What instrument is that? Are they horns? Oh! Oh my god! What a song! Ah. That was their debut song? That was their first song? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What a song to start off with. Oh my God. Wow. Okay. I need the wine. So beautiful. Amazing. Oh my God. I love that. I you know Pirate King, that chorus, they drop into the chorus where they like sit back into it. They look so cool. They look just so suave and cool. I also love and really appreciate the control they have over their bodies. The like real hard hitting sharp movements. They are like on point and they are so in unison. You can tell that they have practiced this so many times and they're just like on point perfectly with each other. I'm just like, I'm floored. I'm floored and amazed and like so excited. Honestly, I wanted to watch the dance practice videos more than more than music videos because you're going to see more of them. I don't know. It's just... I find it more enjoyable. That was, mm, that was great. That was really good. So what have we done? We've watched Gorilla. We did Say My Name. We did Deja Vu, Pirate King. How long have I been filming? I don't know. My battery will die soon. Should I watch another one? Mm, let's just watch Halazia because I, because <laughs> I wanted to watch the choreo for this too. Let's, let's put on Halazia. This was my second favorite of the four I listened to, but I mean, Pirate King is up there now for me. And Deja Vu was really good. Let's just watch the Halazia one. Yeah, my battery isn't dead yet. So let's just, let's just watch that. Yeah, okay. Let's watch this dance practice because I've been wanting to watch this since last week. So let's watch it. Oh, they have backup dances. Oh, this is gonna make it even better. Oh my god, I love this part, the duo, like the two of them. They only had a fraction of it in the music video. Oh my god. The red hair looks so good on him too. Like, bam. Oh my god, is he on someone's back? <laughs> what are you doing up there? <laughs> This is so hype, I love this so much, I'm turning it up. Oh my god! <laughs> He's just so cool. He's so cool. Oh my God, the backup dancers. He always raps with backup dancers. It's just him. Oh my God. <laughs> looks so good. <gasps> oh my God, it's a cannon. I love cannons. Oh my god. Wait, is it a cannon? That's what it's called, right? Look at everyone around him. Oh my god.
we go, here we go. Oh my god. Fuck. <laughs> I'm not prepared. Oh my god, what the hell? I, I'm, I can't. Dude, what the hell? What am I watching? What is, what even is this? What, why? Okay, I'm done. My battery's gonna die soon. So I have to finish off. We just snuck Hellzia into the end. Hopefully my battery doesn't die while I do this outro. Okay, amazing. Let me know if I should do a part three, what I should listen to next, um, what dance practice videos, what I should just check out in general, what you love, just more knowledge. Any and everything, send me links. Any links of things that I should check out as well. Oh, the hell is here. I just, the whole choreo is so good. This stuff is hype. It just makes me happy. Why can't things just make you happy? Why do you have to be ashamed of things that you enjoy? You shouldn't. You shouldn't be ashamed of enjoying stuff like this. No one should. K-pop is amazing. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.